Now let's go to the back end of Joomla and we're going to take a look at how the T4 framework works. So let's click on site template styles. Now from here you're going to notice that you have several options. I know it looks like a lot going on but don't worry about it. I'll I explain what's going on here. So one of the beautiful things about Joomla and content management system is that you can assign a different layout for different sections of your website. So for example, if you have a membership website and you want the home page to look different from the members page, you can assign any one of this layout to be specifically just for the member section. Or if you want to give your blog to look like uh, this grid right here, let's say you want the blog to look like this, right? You can assign this particular template to the blog page. So any one of these templates you see here, you can assign it to different pages. On You have unlimited options. So again, if you're building a website and you have a lot of different parts going and you want to give each part a different look, a different feel, that's really great because you can customize each template individually and then put everything together. So let's go back. So that's why you see all this different uh, once here what they do you can just copy one you can create your own now I'm not going to go into creating your own that's from a more advanced and professional uh, training I want to keep things simple and right here you see this default this is to let you know that this is the default template this is what people are going to see when they come on the home page when they come in the front end of the site this is the you know the default here 